Chapter 1. The Unseen Challenges Have you ever pondered about the unseen challenges faced by individuals with developmental disorders? It's a journey that's invisible to many, but very real to those who live it every day. Imagine navigating a world that often misunderstands you, a society that, while advancing in many ways, still struggles to fully comprehend the unique intricacies of developmental disorders. This is the reality for many individuals and their families. Dealing with not just the disorder itself, but also the emotional, physical, and financial strain it can bring. These families are confronted with a myriad of obstacles, from the lack of understanding and empathy in the public sphere, to the daunting task of securing the necessary support and therapies. They face a constant battle not against the disorder itself, but against a world that's yet to fully embrace their differences. But amidst these challenges, a concept called dark motivation emerges as a beacon of hope. Chapter 2. Understanding Developmental Disorders Developmental disorders, a spectrum of conditions often misunderstood, rarely fully grasped. These are a group of conditions that arise due to an impairment in physical, learning, language, or behavior areas. They are about as diverse as the people they affect, presenting an array of unique challenges and experiences. Let's delve into a few of these disorders. Autism Spectrum Disorder, or AST, is characterized by challenges. With social skills, repetitive behaviors, speech, and nonverbal communication. Although AST can be diagnosed at any age, it is termed developmental disorder because symptoms generally appear in the first two years of life. Then we have Attention Deficit Hyperactivity Disorder, or ADHD, a brain disorder marked by an ongoing pattern of inattention, hyperactivity, and impulsivity that interferes with functioning or development. Dyslexia, another common developmental disorder, affects a person's ability to read and write. Despite having normal or above average intelligence, individuals with dyslexia often struggle with spelling, decoding words, and comprehension. These and many other developmental disorders are typically diagnosed through a combination of assessments and observations. Health professionals look at a child's behavior and development, often involving a team of specialists to ensure a comprehensive evaluation. Now, it's important to note that living with a developmental disorder is not about dwelling on limitations, but about understanding and working with them. Experts in the field, from psychologists to occupational therapists, tirelessly work to unravel the complexities of these conditions. Their insights, coupled with ongoing research, help to shape therapies and interventions that can make a world of difference in the lives of those affected. Above all, it's crucial to remember that people with developmental disorders are just that people. They have hopes, dreams, talents, and potential, just like everyone else. They are not defined by their disorder, but by their individuality. With this understanding, we can begin to appreciate the resilience and determination of those living with these disorders. Chapter 3. The Power of Dark Motivation Now, let's delve into the concept of dark motivation, a driving force born from adversity. This term may sound intense, even ominous, but it's actually a source of profound strength and resilience. Dark motivation, in essence, is the act of using personal struggles, hardships, or challenges as fuel to push forward, to strive for progress, to overcome and succeed. Imagine, if you will, a tree. This tree is growing on a rocky hillside where the soil is sparse and the winds are strong. Yet, it doesn't just survive, it thrives. Its roots dig deeper, its trunk grows stronger, 
and its branches reach higher. This tree is a perfect metaphor for dark motivation. The rocky hillside represents the challenges faced by individuals with developmental disorders. While the tree symbolizes their resilience and determination to flourish despite the odds. Let's look at some real life examples. Consider Sarah, a young woman with autism. Social interactions were a daily struggle for her, leading to feelings of isolation and frustration. But Sarah didn't let this discourage her. Instead, she used her experiences as a catalyst, a dark motivation to pursue a career in social work. She wanted to ensure that no one felt as misunderstood and alone as she had. Or think about James, a father of a child with Down syndrome. The daily challenges of supporting his son, while often daunting, fueled his passion to advocate for children with developmental disorders. His dark motivation led him to establish a non-profit organization that provides resources and support for families just like his. These stories highlight the transformative power of dark motivation. It's about turning adversity into a driving force, using personal struggles as a catalyst for change, for growth, for progress. These individuals aren't defined by their developmental disorders. Instead, they're defined by their resilience, their determination, and their ability to turn their challenges into a source of strength. These stories are testament to the power of dark motivation, a beacon of hope in navigating the challenges of developmental disorders. So, just like the tree on the rocky hillside, we can all learn to use our struggles as a source of motivation. To grow stronger and reach higher, no matter what challenges we face. Chapter 4, Advocacy and Action Understanding and empathy are the first steps, but advocacy and action truly make a difference. Advocacy can be a powerful tool that amplifies the voices of individuals with developmental disorders and ensures their needs are met. It's about standing up for the rights of these individuals, speaking out against discrimination, and promoting social inclusion. It's important to remember that advocacy is not a one-size-fits-all approach. There are many ways to advocate effectively. Sometimes it's as simple as raising awareness by sharing information and stories. Other times, it involves lobbying for policy changes or supporting. Organizations that provide resources and support for individuals with developmental disorders. Promoting acceptance and inclusion are key components of advocacy. Acceptance starts with acknowledging and respecting the diversity of human experiences and abilities. It means recognizing that every person, regardless of their developmental differences, has unique strengths and potential. Inclusion, on the other hand, is about creating environments where everyone feels valued and can fully participate. This could be in schools, workplaces, or even in social settings. Inclusion is not just about physical accessibility, but also about removing attitudinal barriers and fostering a culture of respect and understanding. Expert advice suggests that one of the most effective ways to support and advocate is through education. By learning about different developmental disorders and their impacts, we can challenge misconceptions and stereotypes. It's also vital to listen to and learn from individuals with developmental disorders and their families. Their lived experiences provide invaluable insights that can guide our advocacy efforts. So, let's take these steps together. Let's strive for a world where individuals with developmental disorders are not just understood and empathized with, but also actively supported and included. Whether it's through raising awareness, advocating for policy changes, or supporting organizations that champion these causes, every action counts. Remember, advocacy is not a solitary act. It's a collective endeavor. 
It's about building a community of allies who are committed to making a difference. Your action can make a significant difference in someone's life. So, let's start today, because every step we take brings us closer to a more inclusive and compassionate world. Chapter 5. A Brighter Future Imagine a world where everyone, regardless of their developmental differences, can thrive. A world where acceptance and understanding replace stigma and misconception. This is the power of dark motivation, a force that ignites the spark of resilience and determination within us. It's the fuel that propels us to venture into the unknown, to overcome adversity, and to emerge stronger. In this world, every individual is valued not in spite of their differences, but because of them. They are seen as unique threads in the fabric of our society, each adding their distinct color, texture, and pattern. This is a world where the term developmental disorder does not connote a deficit, but a difference, a unique perspective, a precious gift. But how do we get to this brighter future? It's a journey that begins with each one of us. It starts with fostering empathy, with understanding that what we perceive as normal is just a tiny fraction of the vast spectrum of human experiences. It continues with education, with learning about the various developmental disorders, their characteristics, and the unique challenges they present. It's about stripping away the fear and misconception that often surround these disorders and replacing them with knowledge and understanding. The journey also involves advocacy, speaking up for those who may not be able to speak for themselves, ensuring their needs are met, their rights are upheld, and their voices are heard. And most importantly, it's a journey of inclusion, of creating spaces where everyone regardless of their developmental differences, can belong, can contribute, and can thrive. The transformative power of dark motivation can help us embark on this journey. It can inspire us to turn adversity into advantage, to transform challenges into opportunities, and to light the way towards a brighter, more inclusive future. We are on the cusp of a new era, one where our understanding and acceptance of developmental differences are not just optional, but essential. One where the unique strengths and abilities of every individual are recognized and celebrated. Together, we can illuminate the path towards a brighter future for all.